Rap, rap is out of control. All right, let's get to our guest. We got my man Molecules in the place. Yes, 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 yes. The yes. Legion. Yes, yes. You know yes, what I'm saying? Yes, dice Man in the place as yes, well. Dice, Dice. Yeah. So, um, yeah. We, we, so you came late. You missed. You missed. I already played um, hardcore. Oh, man. Couldn't wait. I oh, man. Like, Yo, just, man. Just, it just man, fit. I was here and no parking, man. I'm like, <laughs> don't. T- that's what Kala tells me every week. <laughs> I <laughs> found it right in front. I <laughs> got it today. I got you it. You know where we live. <laughs> like, no parking, man. Get here but, early. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I know, man. That was my bad, E. <laughs> nah, nah, that was all good. But yeah, we, we play hardcore from the Bronx Tale EP, which is officially out there right now, all entirely produced by Showbiz. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a, it's a, it's a, Fire. It's a great little EP right there. Thank you. And word has it that there there is talk about a full length album coming. Yeah, man, it's coming, man. We, me and Show, we about to sit down and, and and go over some some music, man. We've been talking about it since last week, so uh, okay. I'm gonna get to the lab and um put my ears on something. Right. Exactly. So, so now let's let's uh obviously there's a, a deep history between um you know Legion DITC. Uh, I know Drez brought you into the game, um, and you actually worked with Show back in the day. But how did that? When, when was your first memory of meeting Show? Oh man, um, Dad, I'm trying to think real quick. Uh, I, I met Show before the records even came out, before okay. Soul Clap and all that came out. Uh huh. And then, um, you know, because Show's from Forest, mm-hmm. and I'm from the Soundview section of the Bronx, so you know, it's pretty. Pr- close proximity and I got family from around Forest area. Right. So me and Show, you know, we have mutual friends. We knew each other. And then um I was running around with Drez mm-hmm. right right around the time they dropped their first single on um, Flavor 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 of the Month. Right. And then um me and Show end up building our own close relationship where we was always running together, hanging out, my son and his son would run, would run together and, that, and that's another thing I'll point out on the back of the album yeah. on, on the back of the EP mm-hmm. is a picture of me and show mid 90s right on the top and then on the bottom is a picture of me and him with our sons right. at my son's birthday party 20 years later and then 20 years later we took the same picture and tried to <laughs> st- and it's so crazy it wasn't planned but right, the picture right, was right. like we were standing in the same right. positions like I'm on one end shows right. another and, and, and our son's in the middle so I thought I looked at the pictures. I was like, "Yo, that's crazy!" Like me and me and my man, we go way back. Right. So um, yeah. So when he when they we all was kind of on the same label. We was on Mercury Polygram, mm-hmm. and they were on. I forgot, but they were on Polygram as well. Right. So they were working on the album on Runaway Slave. Mm-hmm. So he was like, "Yo, Q's, um, I want you to come in and do an intro." He always we used to mess with me, say, "Yo, you got an ill voice or whatever," but. Right. I always felt I was a producer. I never right. really felt I was a rapper, MC, or anything like that. So when he put the beat on, I just kind of, we were just like freestyling it, how, whatever came to us. So right. when the beat came on, I was like, yo, the Legion's in the house. Yeah, Molecules is. So yeah. he kept it, and then um, he put it on. That was the intro to the <laughs> joint. And then, um, you know, we just been friends since. So, right. you know, um fast forward into like in the yeah, mid 90s 95 somewhere in there he had a situation with sony right and he was like um i want you to do a, a solo song on, right. the, on the project and um i did the song it was called revenge mm-hmm. and uh he released it in asia somewhere um china or japan right and they didn't do a, a, a major release in the states it was right. just over there so you know the internet makes everything and put everything right in front of you. Sure. So people got wind of the song and was like, yo, Q's, um, Showbiz got this kid, Q's from the Legion, they got a song, it's hot. So fast forward, I was like, yo, man, um, people talking. Right, right, yo, right. Yo, man, let's let's shoot a video for that joint. <laughs> and I was like, yo, I don't care how old it is. You know, they, <laughs> yo, that song's like 20-something years old. Right, I was like, right. I don't care, man, we shooting a video. <laughs> so we shot the video. I shot the video at my crib in yeah. different places. You know, my family's from the islands, from St. Thomas, so I shot, scene, shot a scene or two out there, and um, the video came out good. And then more buzz, right. more, more talk. Yeah. And then next thing you know, I'm like, yo, man, you know, I'm not Dice and, and Rollo. We got, you know, Rollo Square in the building Shout with me. Rollo. And um, Rollo would keep me up to post, keep me posted on what was going on social media, and people would be like, yo, um... They talking about revenge. Right. Somebody said, made a comment she like, love. it would be dope 
if Q's and Show worked on a, on a project together. Right. So I went back to show and he, I was like, yo, man, look, I think that we need to do do a song or two or something. And next thing you know, we banged out like six songs real mm-hmm. quick. And um, now we here, Bronx yeah, Tale. That's it, Bronx Tale, Molecule, Showbiz. Cop that, man. I, Cop it, download yo, man, it, buy it. Front to back, man. We're giving it. y'all some straight hip hop, some straight raw. And, you know, for the guys that want to spit, don't want to hear my vocals, it's instrumentals <laughs> on there. You know what I'm saying? So exactly. y'all, that's, that's you know, a big deal. That's make dope. your own songs. Yeah, exactly, yeah. man. This is this is a good thing. Y'all gotta go check that out. Exactly. We and got it, we got two videos out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bad guy, the first joint leak with the uh, Money Ray. Yep. And then um, Hardcore you know, followed up with Hardcore. That's, that's featuring the joint my man right Drez there. from yeah. Black Sheep. Dice. You got a solo album coming. Yeah, man. I'm excited, man. Produced by my man, Molecules, Molecular, ah, nice. checking you. Yeah. So yeah, I, yeah. I'm, I'm excited, man, because uh, uh, like I heard, I was listening to somebody the other day, man, and um, uh, it, we get to establish our sound finally. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like a lot of MCs jump on, do projects with a lot of different producers, not really establishing their sound. Sure, I, I feel like the Legion always had a sound, and sure. we always had our own style. And, and and me getting to do my project kind of helps establish that sound. You know, even though with Bronx Tale, it, it's it's it sounds like something Molecules would have produced. I'm right. sure that's why he picked them joints. But right. uh, yeah, I'm excited, man. I can't wait. There's a reissue of the Legion album, yeah. Theme Plus Echo yep. Equals good Crew, music. Yep. That. on Fat Beats. Y'all yes. can go get that, too. Go to FatBeats.com, and you can get that reissue. You can get um, the Bronx Tale CD. You can get the Bronx Tale vinyl, vinyl, vinyl. EP. Yep. And then um, Fat Beats is distributing Illadrenaline, so you can also pick up the Lost Tape stuff through exactly. Fat Beats. Yeah. You can, you can go to, to FatBeats.com and get everything. Yeah. Exactly. There you go. Right there. You there. Go.